Atlanta, Texas, population 6,000. Post office and FBI officials say this is where many of the letter bombs are being mailed from, dropped in these collection boxes at the local post office. But no clues left here as to who's doing the mailing. 20 miles up the road in Texarkana, the post office processes mail from Atlanta and 60 other small towns. This is where nearly all the letter bombs have been postmarked from, some also mailed here. Security is tight. Mail normally processed by automatic machines, now getting a second going over by postal inspectors. They are looking for large manila envelopes with no return addresses and a slight bulge in the middle. Why do you think that this post office is being used as the center of this operation? Well, I can't say that it is being used at the center of the operation. Uh, and as to why some might have been mailed here, I, I really just don't know. Is the danger over, do you think? Well, they haven't been caught yet. Because this city is a junction point for all types of transportation, the FBI is investigating the possibility the letter bomber or bombers are flying here, depositing their mail, and quickly returning, possibly to Colorado. This letter bomb ordeal is now receiving top priority attention from all law enforcement agencies. Investigators saying that information gathered so far indicates they are dealing with a group of professional fast-moving extortionists. Investigators hoping that someone will soon come forward with a valuable tip or the letter bombers will make a mistake in what up to now has been a flawless scheme. Bob Serkin, Channel 8 News, Texarkana.